How strong is a Komodo dragon compared to other reptiles? In many movies, the most feared reptile is often depicted as a crocodile or a massive snake. But perhaps these animals need to step aside a different animal, may be vying for the title of king of the reptiles. This animal is well known, the Komodo dragon. But how much do you really know about the Komodo dragon? Do you know its size and strength? And how does its strength compare to that of other reptiles? Can the Komodo dragon truly claim the title of the king of all reptiles on planet Earth? Komodo Dragons It's time we meet the Komodo dragon up close and personal. Well, not too close. You should definitely keep your distance as they aren't friendly. For those terrified by their appearance, you're in luck. They aren't found in many places in the world. Komodo dragons are strictly found on specific islands in Indonesia, including Komodo, from which they take their name, Rinka, Flores, and Gili Matong. Komodo dragons are the largest lizards on the planet. An adult male is about 8.5 feet long on average and weighs between 150 to 170 pounds. However, many Komodo dragons in the wild have been found measuring 10 feet long and weighing around 200 pounds. Even at their minimum size, they are gigantic and terrifying. They are bigger than most humans and weigh about the same, sometimes even more. Due to their size, they are not only apex predators on the islands where they live, but they also dominate those environments. Their size may even be influenced by the lack of other predators on these islands. Unlike some habitats where multiple predators contend for dominance, creating uncertainty about the apex predator, there is no question on these islands. Everyone knows it's the Komodo dragon. It's like putting a T-Rex in a petting zoo, there will be a lot of unhappy visitors, but it's clear who's in charge. Komodo dragons have around 60 serrated teeth, each about an inch long. You can imagine that a Komodo dragon bite would not feel pleasant. Their bite force is recorded between 500 to 600 pounds per square inch, PSI. Although this bite force is significant, it's not the most powerful in the animal kingdom. Yes, it will cause serious damage, but the Komodo dragon relies on more than just its bite. Many of their teeth are curved, which causes devastating injuries when sunk into prey or an opponent. Additionally, they have venom glands in their lower jaw, which means a Komodo dragon bite often injects venom into the victim. The venom prevents blood from clotting, making it hard for the wound to heal. As if the bite weren't bad enough, Komodo dragons also have long, sturdy claws. They depend on these claws to slash at prey with their dexterous limbs. The claws usually measure one and three quarters inches long, nearly twice the length of their teeth. A Komodo dragon will typically attack its prey by delivering slashes and bites. In many cases, the prey escapes, but not for long. The Komodo dragon doesn't need to chase it down. It just waits for the prey to succumb to its injuries. Once the prey dies, the Komodo dragon moves in to consume it. This hunting method is incredibly effective. The Komodo dragon is extremely powerful, capable of taking down large animals, and it can get aggressive. If it perceives a threat, it will attack. You may wonder if Komodo dragon attacks on humans have occurred. Yes, they have, and it never ends well for the human. But how does the Komodo dragon compare to other reptiles? Python Let's take a look at one massive snake, the reticulated python, the world's longest python and the world's longest snake. It is also the third heaviest snake. Reticulated pythons are often just short of 20 feet long, though some have been recorded at over 21 feet. They can weigh up to 165 pounds. They typically prey on small mammals and birds, but larger reticulated pythons have been known to hunt pigs, deer, and in one case, a small sun bear. They have also been known to prey on humans. The reticulated python ambushes its prey, wraps around it, and constricts it until it dies. Smaller ones can apply 10 pounds of pressure per square inch, while the largest can apply up to 50 pounds per square inch. Despite the python's size and strength, could it really constrict a Komodo dragon? The dragon has its own defenses, its bite, 
its teeth, its claws, and its sheer power. All it needs is to land one slash or bite and wait. The Komodo dragon usually outweighs the python, making it difficult for the python to overpower it. Alligator Now let's compare the Komodo dragon to an even larger reptile, the American alligator. The average American alligator is 13 feet long and weighs 790 pounds. They've got a few feet and several hundred pounds on the Komodo dragon. And remember, the Komodo dragon's bite force is between 500 to 600 psi. In comparison, the American alligator's bite force is a staggering 2,000 psi or more. Although the American alligator is superior in size, weight, and bite strength, the Komodo dragon has extremely tough skin. Komodo dragons have armor-like scales reinforced by tiny bones called osteoderms, similar to chainmail. Alligators have osteoderms too, as do many reptiles. But Komodo dragons have four distinct patterns of osteoderms, making their hide even tougher. As long as the Komodo dragon stays out of the water, it could be fine. On land, the Komodo dragon is far more agile than an alligator. An alligator cannot turn as quickly as a Komodo dragon, allowing the Komodo to get behind it, slash, bite, and wait. While the alligator has more power, the Komodo might win through superior agility. King Cobra Now let's take a look at the world's largest venomous snake, the King Cobra. Found in Asia, King Cobras can reach between 10 and 13 feet long. Though not the most venomous of all snakes, a bite from a King Cobra is still deadly. It's said that 50 to 60% of untreated King Cobra bites are fatal to humans. However, these snakes typically weigh only around 20 pounds. Although their venom could bring down an elephant, the King Cobra would struggle against a Komodo dragon. The Komodo dragon's tough, armor-like skin would likely prevent the cobra's fangs from penetrating. Additionally, the Komodo dragon's size advantage and agility make it likely that it would overpower the King Cobra before the snake could land a successful bite. Alligator Snapping Turtle Next, let's compare the Komodo dragon to an alligator snapping turtle the largest freshwater turtle in the world. These turtles can grow up to 32 inches long and weigh as much as 170 pounds, similar to the weight of the Komodo dragon, though not as long. The alligator snapping turtle has a powerful and fast bite, with a bite force of 1,000 psi almost twice as strong as the Komodo dragons. They can also bite at speeds of 200 miles per hour with a neck that can extend out two-thirds the length of their shell. However, the turtle is much slower than the Komodo dragon. Although the turtle's bite is stronger, the Komodo dragon has greater strength in its body and forelimbs. As long as the Komodo can avoid the turtle's powerful bite, it could overpower the turtle by targeting a vulnerable spot. Anaconda We've already looked at the world's longest snake, the reticulated python, but now let's meet the second longest and heaviest snake, the green anaconda. Green anacondas are found primarily in South America and are semi-aquatic. They can grow up to 17 feet long and weigh 170 pounds. Although not venomous, green anacondas are constrictors. Their bite force is strong 900 psi, and their squeeze can apply 90 pounds per square inch of pressure, similar to an elephant stepping on you. If a green anaconda managed to wrap itself around a Komodo dragon, the dragon could be in trouble. However, as we always say about the Komodo, all it needs is one slash or one bite. Once that wound is inflicted, the Komodo just needs to wait for its venom to take effect. Crocodile. Finally, let's look at the world's largest reptile, the saltwater crocodile. These massive creatures can reach 21 feet long and weigh over 2,200 pounds, about 11 times the weight of a Komodo dragon. Their most fearsome trait is their bite force, 
which is one of the strongest in the animal kingdom at 3,700 psi. In a fight, the Komodo dragon would be vastly undersized, and the crocodile's bite could be devastating. However, the crocodile's size comes with some drawbacks. On land, the Komodo dragon is much faster and more agile. While the crocodile may overpower the Komodo dragon in size, the Komodo could evade attacks long enough to land a few slashes or bites and retreat before the crocodile could deliver a fatal blow. Luckily for the Komodo dragon, it doesn't encounter crocodiles on its islands, so it remains safe from these massive reptiles for now.